Good morning, everybody. Here we are at the store. It's more quiet. Well, uh, not gonna spend much time on this morning's. Uh, That's where we set up camp last night. There we go. Just behind some sort of uh, bell building. But yeah, I'm not gonna show you guys the tear down and everything. You've seen that before. What we got planned for today? Uh, going uh, should be to Winnipeg within a couple hours. So we're gonna try a uh, pastry place. I forget the name of it already, but. Uh, they have actual donuts, uh, not Persian donuts, which were awesome. If you guys saw last episode, the other ones, yeah, not so good. They're, I think I was generous. In donut? I think I was generous with my five out of ten. But yeah, today we should. I, I got confidence in today's donut. And then the big thing later on, we're gonna stop at where they film Corner Gas. So that should be a good time. So anyhow, that's uh, time for that driving montage. Cheers. See, we got our bikes parked down this side alley. Uh, fortunately, we just stopped at what's it called? Old Donuts. Old Donuts. Uh, I gotta say, I hope it's good because just the ride to get out of here, it's in Winnipeg somewhere. It's pretty far detour in Winnipeg. And uh, as soon as we tried to turn on one left, there was a car accident, so we couldn't turn there. So we probably added like 20, 25 minutes to this uh, trip to get here. So, and yeah, I got a Schmorris Donut. This all season has a uh, uh, cookies and cream cheesecake. There we go. And of course, gotta have a cup of coffee. So, uh, gonna give this a shot. Hopefully, it's good to go. We're gonna have a quick first bite review and then finish it off and let you guys know what we think of the final product. It better be good because I tell you, the drive to get here was a bit of a pain in the ass. They're a bit of a big city fan. Yeah. And price still on the expensive side. Yeah, we're trying to help the little guys, but my god, I feel like you're trying to rob us sometimes. And yeah, time to get these bad boys out and take a test. Taste, taste test. Ah. Of course, you guys noticed my s'mores craving I've been having with the last few uh, camping nights, so I'm gonna keep it going with the donut. Well, thankfully, my first bite, I gotta say, this is the best donut place we've had so far this trip. Thumbs up from me. Hey, just finished that donut. My final review. Uh, it's hard to beat the Persian man's prices, but I. Uh, I'm right, I'm between an 8, 8.5. Yeah, I'm, I'm around the same, even though it was a little bit more expensive, but you can kind of see why, because they are Everything in there. fancy donuts, yeah. So, uh, I'm in a generous mood. I'm going to give it an 8.5, but I still like to take a half a point away from the first, from the beard's freaking donuts that we had a couple of days ago. They weren't even donuts. Yeah, Should so, we even put them on this list? I don't know, but uh, I know. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll stick with the old donuts. I'm going to give them 8.5. 8. Yeah, uh, I think I think that's a good good rating. I hate giving the same rating as I did yesterday. Cause I don't, uh, so that's where it's a bit between 8 and 8.5. It's your price that kind of... My God, I got like three hornets flying around my motorbike right now. Yeah, let's hope that we don't get stung. So yeah, finish my coffee, hopefully uh, Hornet doesn't get in it, and then we're going to motor on, and uh, we're about six hours from Dog River, so no idea what we'll, we'll see between here and there. So anyhow, see you on the road. Anything you say, Owen? No, I think we'll see you later. Cheers.
again all season adventure with miss all season with you just took a quick stop at the walmart for lunch uh, what do you got for lunch today today is a spicy salami with yep. some cheese and crackers and some, and some goldfish extreme uh, cheddar for myself i got some of the cheapest bread i could find yesterday a little bit smushed so cheap smush bread with some uh just throw it so it's going to be yeah. more smushed. Uh, free peanut butter and jams that I picked up earlier. And some Cheetos for desert. So, not a bad meal. Oh, and we got a monster to keep awake because today, not gonna lie, it is a pretty windy day on the road and you can tell it's not very bright outside. So, it is a little bit of a sluggish day. So, hey, Monster Energy, if you want to sponsor us, here's a little plug. And cheese dogs would be kind of nice. And cheese dogs. Yeah. So anyhow, yeah, we're going to have our lunch and then uh, show you a few more little clips on the road. And hopefully next time you see us is in uh, Dog River, Saskatchewan. Cheers. Good evening everybody, as you guys can tell, made it to our camp spot for the night. It's not a, this is kind of an actual camp spot, as you can see, we got a couple trailers in the back there, but this is free. So you know, all season's not paying for an actual campsite, so we got a free camp spot again, which is kind of nice. Uh, got the bikes parked there, lovely machines, an actual parking spot. Got our tent set up there, got a picnic table and supper. And like I mentioned before, we actually are in uh, Rulo, Saskatchewan. I think I mentioned that earlier today where we're going. So uh, Rulo, Saskatchewan is actually where they filmed uh, the show Corner Gas, one of my favorite shows of all time filmed in Canada. But anyhow, yeah, we're going to have some supper soon, show you guys what we got. Supper, I just got some uh, more of uh, some of Miss All Seasons dehydration, dehydra dehydrated food, if I can say it, and tuna underneath. And Miss All Season has same vegetables with oh little chicken salad thing so that's what we got for supper going on tonight uh, so anyhow we're gonna cook our meal and once we're done our meal we're gonna go walk around and show you different spots they had where the police station was uh, where the bar was where the food mart was where Oscar Lee Roy's house was the actual corner gas uh, Ruby unfortunately that is gone they they got a kind of a sign there so I'll show you what's left but there's not much and when we actually get to the spot i'll show you pictures of when i was here last in 2013 and 2012 so and yeah i'm gonna quickly have our meal and we'll get back to you in a few seconds cheers
Hey everybody, here we are. Actually, the following day, and it's kind of a sad occasion. As in, right where our bikes are right now, that's where you would have had corner gas right there. You would have had a gas station pumped around here, and Lacey's Diner. Uh, as you can see, well, right over there, you got the uh, Dog River. What is that? The, the, the grain mill. Grain mill that they want to knock yeah, it down. They want to tear it down. Yeah. And knock it down. As you can see, there's the pictures of uh, what it used to look like over there. And you would have had your corner gas sign somewhere up there, I imagine. But yeah, it's a little bit different from when I was back here in 2013. When I was back here in 2013, uh, the building was still there. It was more of a kind of a corner gas museum memorabilia stuff. It was pretty cool. I had a shirt, bought a shirt there and a mug that I actually still alive. But anyhow, uh, yeah, yeah, it's kind of fortunate to see how things change, but that's what it is. But uh, I guess with that one, uh, not a, the most cheerful ending, but it's still an ending, go explore. So anyhow, uh, like that. That being said, uh, keep exploring everybody. And until next time, remember to live and cheers.